Hello, Nathan here. You may remember me from stuff like, and yeah, you don't remember me from anything. Anyways, can you guess what game we're talking about today? If you said The Simpsons Hit and Run, then you're freaking stupid. No, today we're talking about NFT and Misadventures. There. Ed, Ed, Nay, The Misadventures was made in 2005 for the Xbox, PS2, PC, and the best console, GameCube, in 2005. I already said that. The game's a 3D platformer where you control all three Eds at the same time. There are six levels and two bonus levels. The gameplay is alright, but there's a few major problems. For one, these graphics are terrible. Now, normally, I'm not one to care about graphics, but this is just ugly to look at. Now, I get that Ed, Ed, and Eddie is a 2D cartoon. It was not meant to be put in 3D. But come on, this looks bad. I mean, like, Ed looks fine. The other Ed looks fine. Kevin, ew. Eddie, oh, God. I feel like I'm gonna need to see a therapist after this. Another problem is the fact that this doesn't feel like Ed, Ed, and Eddie. There were so many references that could have been made, but it's really just a basic platform with an Ed, Ed, and Eddie skin slapped on it. The only references that I can think of are, one, Johnny likes fishing for clams, two, uh, the Edzilla monster, and three, the Eds once built that huge city that one time. However, the jawbreakers you can find in the level do have pretty good references in them. Now, the controls feel fine, but something unique is that each Ed has their own special team move. Ed's is what you use most of the time because it's broken. Ed's is hard but satisfying to use, and Eddie's just sucks. Now, remember when I said this game was ugly? Well, it's also lazily designed. The title screen is just a uh, generic bedroom with the main theme of the show playing on loop, which is not a very good thing to loop. The final boss has no real feeling to it because it just has the generic level music and a few sound effects thrown in to make it feel more special. The credits are just the title screen, and worst of all, the level complete screen. Let me show you. Bam. There. No sound effect, no victory animation, just a bare bones menu, saying that you just complete, complete the level, and shows you the percentage of the entire game you've completed. Come on! Even though this game does have an ugly and lazily designed fan game feel to it, it still can be fun to time to time, and it is kind of my guilty pleasure. Especially the monster level, that one's really fun. So, in conclusion, this game is alright. Not great, but not terrible. So that was Ed, Ed, and Eddie the Misadventures. It's an okay game. I mean, it is fun at times, but... And the game's just presentation-wise isn't that appealing. It doesn't really feel like you're playing the cartoon. Let's see if uh, this Game Boy version can do any better. The Game Boy version of this game. Great! Um, I actually forgot to mention in the GameCube portion of the video that um, The Misadventures has good music, but it's just reused from the show, no original tracks. But here, it's original music, and it's really good. The sprite work is good, uh, references are even less, but the drawbreakers are still really funny. But apart from that, this game is really fun. Rather slow paced at times, but really fun. I love it. So yeah, the weak Game Boy Advance version is superior to the, the, the high-powered advertised one. Huh. Anyways, roll the cartoon! Ooh! A door! To open me, you must defeat this dragon. So for Stacey Olvney, when is your guy past the garrison and he goes to our arm? Good thing dragons are allergic to beans! That was weird. Okay, door, open up. 
Mm, how about you open up? Hmm. So I just feel useless all the time, and I have no real friends, and these eggs smell weird, and I'm a loser. Uh... Wasn't that cartoon amazing? No. Uh, well, I personally like the part with the. With the. Uh, oh, yeah, that's right. I haven't actually made the cartoon yet. I have no idea. I like the part where. Um, the, the guy cries like a little girl. Did you like that part? No? No, with the first episode, I had, I had a way to end these videos, but uh, I got nothing. I'll be doing this again next week. See you then.